You gotta know this sound right here, Abbott. Zelda Link to the Past, baby. It's your boy Corona Boy Thurs GNR getting back in on it. Last time we left off, y'all, we got our first pendant, y'all. All right. So we're gonna go ahead and start from my house. Last time we were up over on the far east side. Far east side. Y'all see the little desert inside the little square up there? That's where the last medallion was. We're gonna come over here, right here to this one. And we're gonna go here and get this pendant right here. After we get that pendant, this blue pendant, we're gonna go to the very top and get the red pendant. I think today we're only gonna go for this blue pendant. I may do some explorations around, some cave spelunking. We might try to figure that out. Yeah, we're gonna get a hopping and popping from there. All right, let's get it, man. So, got our arrows, getting started, right? So we got the knuckleheads here. I had to get his attention with the sword blast real quick. So y'all remember, if I, uh, I try not to get hit by none of these dudes, man. We gotta use my tools. Remember we talking about the tools, right? So we got the boomerang here. Boomerang would've worked good on all three of them dudes. Dude, I got the, I got the fast running boots. We got any fairies? I got fairies already. How many jars we got? We got two jars? Okay, so I can go ahead and touch this fairy. I can't collect it. Go ahead and get that one. Uh, yeah, okay. We're gonna keep it moving, y'all. We're trying to get over here to that far east side. The far, actually, this is the west side. I don't know why I said the east side. Are you trying to, you trying to, you trying to play games real quick, bro? Tool, tool them. Oh! Slap them both real quick with the boomerang. Go ahead and smack them up real quick like this. Okay, let me take a look at the map real quick. We need to go all of, so I actually need to go back to the right. I need to go back to the right and down, uh, down in that little, that little, if y'all can see the little sliver in between the middle of the screen I have right there, we need to go back down that way. So we're gonna head east and then south, all right? It took too long for me to figure it out. Do I go down this way or what? We gotta keep going south right here, man. I can't go down that way, so. Let him rock out right quick with his with his bow and arrow. He's being dumb. I'm ricocheting them right. Oh, oh, dang, dang. You got me. All right, so. Hold on, y'all. Hold on. So we ha it's The map is so strange how it looks like this, man. So that was my reason, man. That's the only reason why I didn't. I, that's the only reason why I like more games over Twilight Princess. I like the concept of Twilight Princess. I like the graphics and all that good stuff. I think everything was pretty much cool about it. But it just, uh, just the fact that I need to be, I needed a guide. And that's probably just me, I guess, cause you know, I suck at gaming, but you know, it's still fun though, still fun. He comes after me. I need to get a bigger shield, man. Uh, let's see. We gotta go over here this way. We gotta be careful in this. This place is like very active. There's a lot of enemies in this place. Enemies hiding in the grass. You got these octopus dudes spitting rocks at you. Where we go? Where we going? We're going up right here. Nope, this ain't the spot. We gotta go down further. But he's trying to come at me. We got the the freaking crows coming at me. I still gotta get this. I still gotta get my glove, my mitts. Check this out right here, y'all. This way to the Desert of Mystery. Here we go, the Desert of Mystery. That's because you were bad at it. Skyward Sword was easier in comparison. You're right, you're right, and that's exactly what I'm saying. I'm just... Did, I just didn't, it was just harder for me, so. So check out this middle-aged guy. Check this out, let me read his, uh, pay no attention to the average middle-aged man standing by this sign. Leave him alone. I'm gonna talk to him. He sleeps. There's something I gotta do here, man, and I know like there's a there's a glove that I need. I need this glove. I think I might have to go get the glove before I even come in here. And then, okay, so we got little our little book of magic that we need. I always feel kind of sorry for those little. I guess they're spiders under the rock. I guess I like to call them. I don't know, man. 
Let's go ahead and get our wounds soothed real quick. Twilight Princess is the best because it is rated T. Is it rated T Zelda game? T for what? What's T for? I hate how that crow comes at you and then you hit it one time and it's like he don't want no more smoke so he goes away. All right, y'all, so this is the crazy part. I always do this when I come in here messing with these freaking uh, vultures. This is, that's how I always defeat them. Let them get close over here. Magic, we're gonna need that magic. T for team, okay. So the other the other ones were uh, have a higher rating. Whoa. See these sand guys be coming out of nowhere, man? I don't like these sand guys either, man. So then you got this part right here, right? Check this out. I don't, I don't remember how I knew that I had to do this. There's probably someone who tells me to use the book right here. But you use the book right here, y'all. And it says, to open the way, to open the way to go forward, make your wish here and it will be granted. He's really making a wish, bruh. He's really making a wish. I feel like he took off his hat to make the wish too. They were lower E if I remember correctly. Okay, I got you. Uh, but yeah, so here we are. We're getting ready to go ahead and go into the Western Hemisphere, I call it. What did they call it? The the desert? The, the something desert? But I really feel like in here, we there's something that we need. I think we need, I feel like we need that, that glove, man. We need those gloves. These things are kind of, I just hate, I don't like these guys because they're buried and then they come out of the sand and like, I don't know, they're just, you swipe them with the sword and it takes two hits. I don't know. I like, I like the one hit, one hit and quit. You know what I'm saying? One hit wonder. Oh, I hate these things up here. You see this, that thing with the freaking eye up there at the top? Shoots lasers out of that eye. See that? Look, he shoots lasers, man. And there's really, I don't think there's even a way to beat them. I like this music though. Hurry up, get in there. Okay. Stayed away from him on purpose. That dude sucks because they they like throw they spit rocks or something at you. And then also it's like quicksand going in towards them. I I don't want to go down here, man. Y'all remember these green guys right here? From these dudes? See, look, you got this right here. You got this dude. Do it too early. Ah! Let me get these. Let me get these guys that's, that's digging around. Oh, oh. Oh! See, look. Do you see how they just keep coming? They just keep waking up? And I think these purple ones are even stronger. No? Okay. So we got we got two of those guys here, man. Hit him like that, cool. I'm glad that one pot destroys him. Pot right there, okay. Let's get we what's it? A compass. Oh, the map. Okay, we take the map. We take the map. Let's see, what we got more magic. I'm pretty sure we're probably gonna need some magic. I'm, I'm glad they, they're filling us up on the magic, man. So let's take a look at the map. Let's take a look at the map. How you use the map? Uh, I don't know how to use it. How do we use it? Select? No? Okay, you press X to use the map. Just like... Okay, so... We... Are we the flashing light? I think we're the flashing light, I think. Let me see. Yeah, that's us, the flashing light. So we gotta go back down here. Go this way. All these enemies here, we're just gonna bypass those. I don't know why I came in here and talked to this dude, but we do have to uh, run and jab this, uh, run and jab that to get that key. Let's go talk to Sir Harsler real quick. 
There's I, Slahar Slithera. Thirds, you must never fail to find all the treasures in each dungeon. So we have, he's telling us get, get each and every last treasure box that we can get. Every treasure. So that just makes me think also, ah, spit fire at me, no spit fire. Okay, two hits. Um, not to, that we have to kill every enemy, but for me, it's just like a habit kind of thing. Especially because they give stuff like hearts and magic. Like, I gotta go for the enemies, man. This part sucks. No, oh, don't hit me! There's a, I'm sure there's a tile that we have to step on in order to, uh, get a sense. See, there we go. And see, now I just want to check all the other pots. For treasures and rupees and arrows and hearts and stuff which i don't need hearts but magic we need to fill our magic all the way up so that's one thing we're working on dinner's done i'll catch you later appreciate it abbott uh do your thing homie do what you gotta do man uh good child too good child hope you enjoy your dinner so let's light these up real quick and see what we can get going man it's not gonna do anything we need the big key Gotta get the big key, so we're working on that. Go step on the tile again to open up all the doors. Always get the freaking map button mixed up. So from here, so we gotta go down and then to the left. Go down all the way and into the left. All the way down here. Slice him two times. We gotta come over here to the left. Bro, come on. I'm gonna skip all the freaking... So I'm sure we probably have to light all these up in order to open that door right there. No? Uh, maybe we have to push one of these? Ah, I hate it. I don't know if we have to push one or not. I'm just, I'm just trying it out. push all these hopefully maybe one of these will open this door there we go all right cool got it oh, it's, i didn't even freaking heat it i didn't even fairies in here give me a little bit more life do i need them maybe i'll save these guys man i'll save those we got plenty of fairies we're good so now how do i get back in there i can't I didn't need the fairies, though. I couldn't stock up on them regardless, so... It would have been good to just go ahead and get them, right? Oh! Hit him! And he comes back here behind me. Heart, heart. Let's throw a pot at this guy and see what happens. I bet... I think when you throw a pot, it don't do nothing to him. Yo, yeah, okay, there it does. Okay, cool, cool. Need hearts. Uh, let me see. Seasoned oven baked chicken, broccoli, and fries. Sounds good, man. I wonder what we have for dinner now, man. So we've been everywhere. We gotta go to the we gotta go to the east side now. So we're gonna head over to the east side, knock that out real quick. And then we'll head up to the first the I think we're in the basement now. I think. I don't know. We'll head over to the other floor. Whoa! Ah! Ah! Do I hear the uh, the indirect fire? Hearts, that's what's up. More hearts, there we go. I like it. So now we gotta come down here. There's the door we gotta unlock. And really, we're supposed to go all the way down. Let's go down here and, and, and adventure real quick and see what's down here. Enemy. I need that shield, man. That fire shield. Whoa! Come on. See, you get stuck on him, man. Oh, come on, man. 
That fire is kind of weak. It's not taking away much life. Okay, cool. Got him. Like that. Let's go over here. What was the point of this room? There's literally no point in that room. I don't think. Maybe you push one of the statues? Watch out, don't get hit. Don't get hit again. Okay. I'm just testing it out, y'all. You never know. Never know. You gotta try it just in case. Okay. See, look, the thing that I don't like where he's placed. I see he can this one can be closer to make it equal. See how there's this one row of circles right here? There's two rows of circles over here. That's what makes me think it needs to be pushed. So that room is pointless. Go into the key. Go into the locked room right here. And then there's that room that's up above. We still got to go in there too. Uh. 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 What's this? Is this a compass? Open it. Open it. Good. Compass. 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 All right. So we're going to get keys. That's, that's all I really left to get is keys. I don't think I like this room. Let me check my map real quick. So I think there's something at the end of this room. I feel like it's just a speaker on the wall. Oh, okay, there is. Big key. This It seems like this is going to be an easy... But we still got to go upstairs and there's... They give you the big key early, but there's still this this whole level is puzzly. You gotta def you gotta get through the puzzle of the thing. Let's go see what's up in this room up here. Shit came in here. Oh! Let's come knock him out real quick. Oh, come on. Get him again. Okay, there we go. Pointless room, basically. We didn't have to go in there. Any more hearts? All right, here we go. We're going to go get the big chest so we can see what we got. Was it in here? Was it this way? I don't know. I don't remember if it was this way or not. Yeah, up here. Uh, hit this freaking tile right here. Jump up in there. Here we go. I think this is going to give us the glove that we need. I think. Here we go. Titan's mitt. This is the power glove. And then the Titan's mitt comes up. See, now that we got the now that we got the power glove, now we can go pick up those heavy rocks, man. Ah. I need those fairies now. Come on, really, bro? Hopefully, let me see. I wonder if I can go back down. No, we can't because we already freaking, uh, we just, we might as well just take the hit. We got to go outside. That's what we got to do. Don't touch me. So from here, y'all, we're going to come down here with the quickness. Oh, come on, man. I swung my sword on that dude, man. I swung my sword on him, man. Also, don't mind my last question. Uh, I found an answer. Saying what you talking about? The, uh, to the AGSUs? Oh, okay, hold on. Let me, let me see what you got. He said he found his answer, but now I got to check. Uh, I wanted to ask you about the direct commission. Is that only for chaplains or can it be any type of officer? I, what, what did you get saying? I think it's just for officers. I mean, I think it's just for chaplains. They direct commission like that. I think it's for just for chaplains. There we go. Got my heart, my piece of heart. 
It's only for functional officers and non-commanding officers, non-commander officers. What does that mean, functioning officers? <coughs> I know there's something saying, I think, yeah, see, look, here's the rest of the freaking level right here. And see, now that we, uh, see, there's this little place that we gotta go in here. This place is like a total, it's, it's a puzzle puzzle. I think we even have to go into the dark world to finish this level, if I'm not mistaken, man. Uh, no, I, I'm not sure, man. I don't know. Whoa, don't get it! Okay. Functional officers are chaplains. Chaplains dot, okay. This is what I normally do on this part. This doesn't always work, but this is what I do sometimes. Because I don't like to just dodge these floating tiles. This one might hit right here. To See, I knew that one's probably going to hit. Oh! Oh! There we go. That's normally how I do those flow. We're gonna catch multiple rooms like this with those flow no tiles that come floating at you. And I hate them. They take away so much life, man. I think one tile hits you, it takes away a whole freaking heart. They don't command, but they have officer authority. There you go, okay. Yeah, so even a chaplain, that's right, because I don't think a chaplain is actually a company commander. I feel like it's like the easiest way to get commission to be commissioned. And crazy thing about it, I don't think uh, LT Ferg, I don't think he was a chaplain's assistant at first, man. I don't think he went chaplain's assistant. I think he was just, he was a 12 Charlie and then he just went over to be a chaplain and just commissioned that way. I can't remember exactly how it worked, but. And see, I think with all these, I think we have to light all these torches, man. But all these freaking lasers are coming at us left and right, man. I gotta, we gotta find out how to dodge these freaking lasers. Look how, look how they just hit and hit. We gotta find out. Okay, there's the key. Good, I don't have to light all the torches. I thought I had to light all the torches to get through there. And then we got the floating tiles here. We're, we can ready, and this level's quick, man. But I need fairies. Dang it! I think we're gonna, I think we're gonna, I think we're gonna mess up this dungeon, man. Oh come on! Ah! Dang it, man! Just need a degree and experience in the field. See, but I don't think, uh, I don't think Lieutenant Ferg was a chaplain's assistant, man. Oh, come on, man. Come on! And see, look how much life they take away, man. I need two hearts right here, man. We don't have any more fairies. This guy that we gotta beat I know we're gonna freaking die. I need fairies, man. What if we could beat this dude with three hearts? Okay, good. We're gonna have more than three hearts. Can we get a fairy in one of these freaking buckets? I think this guy, the pot doesn't even bother him, bro. See, the pot doesn't even... Come on, man. The pot doesn't even... But what the heck is happening? It has to be an arrow. That's crazy, man. Seance, baby, you already know what it is, man. Um. Ah, come on. 
So we got it. We still got it. Are we? Yeah, we're on the second floor. How did we make it to the second floor, man? Or we have to go down to the basement. I don't know what. I have no idea what's going on right now, man. I have no idea. Well, I know this wall is going to go over. I know that much, but... See, here's the dude, man. I think he's in here, bro. And we need bombs. I don't even think I have enough bombs to, to get at this dude, man. Bruh, this freaking sucks. You gotta kill all three of these things. I wonder if we can get it, man. I gotta watch out because when they come up, those freaking rocks go diagonal. I thought it was gonna be. I thought it was gonna be a different, uh, a different enemy. I was expecting it to be the uh, that that rhinoceros guy with the freaking with the. Uh, he got a mask, and you gotta throw the bombs at his mask. Gosh, come on, man! Get him! Where's he at? Here he is. Two of them coming out here? No. Come on, man. Let's go. It's, why does it, I don't know why it takes so many hits. Got one going. One down. Two down? No? Come on. Let's get this next one. Two down. This one, two down. Yep, there we go. Last one coming up. And I think he turns. I think he turns. Oh, that's so easy, bro. So easy. That's what I'm talking about. Let me go ahead and catch this pendant. Caught it. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. I thought that was going to be so much harder, man. Because I was expecting it to be... There's like a, a crab guy or something like that. He has a, a hard-faced... He has a shield over his face. And you got to throw bombs. But he moves left and right. So you kind of got to anticipate where he's going. Put the bomb next to his face. It's going to blow chunks of his mask off. And then you got to hit his face. And at the same time, when he stops moving, his tail goes back and forth. And then it comes around and like scorpions you. So that's what I thought it was going to be. All right, so that being said, y'all, we got the second pendant. Let's go ahead and move on before we go up to our next our next pendant. Pendant of life. These dudes come and circle you and they don't even get close enough to freaking touch you.